How to use Leonardo AI image to image generator for free. Hello everyone and welcome back. In today's video, I'll be showing you guys how you can use Leonardo AI's image to image generator. Now you might ask, what's the purpose of using this tool? Because I already can, you know, create images with Leonardo AI. Why would I want a image to image generator? Well, it's actually really useful to use their image to image generator. And a lot of people don't realize is that their image to image generator can help you in creating some really amazing videos. So we're going to go into Leonardo AI. I have logged in and created my account. Now the purpose of image to image is going to help you in defining the type of videos or images you want to create. Especially when you're trying to build videos, you might want certain reference images. So you can take one reference image and then customize it so it can serve as the starting frame for your video. To get started with their image to image generator, simply head on over to Leonardo AI and then click on AI tools on the left and click on image. Once you click on image, you guys can see on the top it asks you to write a prompt. Now you can just click on the top over here where you can add a style reference and then you have image to image. Now this is incompatible with our selected model so you can just click on over here and choose a different model as well. You guys can see we have some platform elements. So what I would do is I would go into my model over here and I'm going to be using let's take this model over here which is lucid realism now from here we are going to choose the appropriate model for image to image because there are several different models and you guys can see we have character reference we don't have their image to image one in Leonardo lightning as well so again you're just going to click on view more and this is for this one so we're going to click on image to image over here we have the source and then the result where it can create creative reinterpretation of vibes or structural references from an image once i do that i can choose the image that i want to use as a reference now this is one of the images that i have created using leonardo so i'm just going to click on this image and then click on confirm and then i want to restyle this image into a futuristic world restyle or i want to restyle this image into a futuristic world high tech white green black colors and then i'm just going to click on generate once i've done that it is going to restyle and recreate my image the best part about using image guidance or image to image generations is that you're able to truly control what type of end result you're going to get so it's truly going to be something that is customized and unique for you now moving forward, we're just going to go on ahead and move into some of the images that have been created. So we're just going to view all of these images and when these are the four alternatives that it has created. So you guys can see these images are pretty decent. This one I don't like because it has put on these, you know, futuristic style glasses, which are not looking so great. Now this is if I'm using the photography preset. If I choose a different preset and then go back into how I want to use image guidance and then I can click on view more and then I can choose which type of image guidance I want to use. Now image guidance is going to differ depending on whatever model you're using. Sometimes image guidance is only available on premium models uh, in certain models or presets, whereas it is available for free in other models. So do keep that in mind whenever you're choosing your image to image. You guys can see it's available in the premium for illustrative when it comes to graphic design let's take a look if this is going to be available again this is not available in graphic design in concept art let's just do a quick look if this is available and again it's not available i do think it's primarily only available within flux schnell or image guidance is available in stock photography other than that you can use some of their other image references you can you know play around with the different ways that you can use image references and this can truly come from any style of image if i go back and then choose the way that i want to include the elements we even have style references character references uh, content references depth to image edge to image text input as well as pose to image so you're able to truly create whatever type of image that you want 
So now I can proceed with moving forward and I can just download this image I've created. I can choose to upscale this as well. And on the left, you can even choose the contrast, the generation mode if you want it to be quality or if you want it to be fast. You can also proceed with using their image dimensions as well as the number of images you want to create. Then you also have collections as well as advanced settings. And th this is how you can create some images from one basic image within Leonardo AI. Now you do have some other features that you can explore within Leonardo AI. And that is going to be their video creator, which has recently been created. Now, even within their video creator, you can use your images as a reference. And that is, again, a really powerful tool to have. You even have their flow state, which allows you to use some of their pre-built prompt. And this is going to, you know, cost one token per image. However, when you are using flow state, you do not have advanced features. Then below that, you also have the feature of using their real-time canvas, real-time generation, canvas editor, and universal upscaler to upscale the content that you have created. Now, if I was to go into my library, I would be able to find all the images or videos that have been created. Now, one really important thing to note is the number of credits that are going to be spent whenever you're creating a image or a video because this is a credit-based system. So because within the credit-based system, you don't want to, you know, spend extra credits on anything, you should opt for using their either their Artisan Unlimited or their Maestro Unlimited plans. Their plans start at $12 and go up to $60. Their Artisan Unlimited is considered their best offer at $30 per month. This is on monthly billing. So if you want to save up to 20%, you can opt for their yearly billing and pay only $24. Now this includes 25,000 fast tokens as well as unlimited image generation at a relaxed pace. You have unlimited generation excluding flow state and GPT with 75 tokens for uh, serious projects as well as the ability to generate own 20 personal models. So it truly is a tool that is going to suffice all of your needs when it comes to AI based content that you might have. So when you're able to create such amazing content, then what are you even waiting for? It's truly something that you should get started with, especially when you're trying to find a good AI tool. And Leonardo truly does cover all types of content formats, whether it's photography, images, upscaling, hyper-realism, animals, artistic styles, or any of the other popular styles that are now trending. You can follow along with all of their simple prompts and you can copy other people's prompts and see what other people are creating for inspiration as well. Now, I hope you guys found this video helpful, and if you guys did find this video helpful, then make sure to leave a like and subscribe. If you have any questions or any queries, you guys can leave those in the comments down below. I would love to know what you guys have to say. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next video.